Number seven, determine the range of the graph. The range is your Y value. So notice on this right here, if we draw a line right through here at three, it goes down, doesn't it? So this dot right here, negative five comma three, this dot is a maximum value. That means on our T-chart, three would be the largest value ever for Y. So this means Y is less than or equal to three. So if the graph opens down, you'll have a less than. Let's go over here. Here's our vertex right here. Go across and it's at negative two, right? So at negative two, our vertex would be two comma negative two, wouldn't it? This right here tells us our range, Y. And notice it goes up, doesn't it? So it's going to be greater than or equal to negative 2. And just for instance, this is our vertex right here. Just a little added information. Our axis of symmetry is going to be the x value in your vertex. So on this one right here, your axis of symmetry is x equal negative 5. That means if you draw a line through negative 5 and fold it over, it matches up. And over here, our axis of symmetry would be x equals 2, would it? If you fold the line over on 2, it would match up. 